I think that's perhaps a challenge whenever I think uh, I'm already, I think, 55 years old and I have been, I think, uh, learned to live my life without kind of to be always online. And I still uh, very much respect for my time whenever I'm not online. But of course, I think that it's very much of a choice that, that you were have a really kind of a switch on, switch off type of thing, that, that, but I think still, definitely, I think that uh, because of the internet, because of the mobile phones, because of all kind of uh, wireless devices that we are having available today, I think that it's so easy to be online or almost even while you are sleeping. But I think that uh, being good or bad, but I think that of course that's great huge opportunities for the people that that it's, uh, whatever was the situation. Uh, I think that when I was uh, young, and I think that, that we had all the kind of uh, uh, wiped uh, lines, and then I think that no chance really to contact your friends. Uh, or you didn't uh, know you had to plan uh, much carefully, more carefully the kind of what you were doing than today. Whenever you know where you. Geolocation services can easily tell where all your friends are and which bar they are sitting and then doing what. Mm. Okay. Otherwise, I must say that uh, that hyperconnected society is, uh, I think, it's, it's pros and cons.